As we try to change the state of Kentucky, it's clear that the only way to really change it is through education, but research is the way to, to drive that nail in deeper so that we make a, a long-term change that will create the kind of jobs that will be sustainable. We are in the business of helping the Commonwealth. And the, you do that simply not by, uh, you know, taking existing knowledge and passing it, but also advancing knowledge. That's a part and parcel of it. Research is a word that a lot of students grow up in Kentucky not understanding. They don't see research going on in their hometown. Many of their teachers uh, did not have research backgrounds. I knew that Kentuckians had a basketball IQ. I mean, they know who missed some shot back in 1952 to cause us to lose a game and, and so forth but they don't have a research IQ. Who's going to teach them that? It's going to have to be us. We are the statewide land-grant university. How do you teach them that? Well, you have to make it real to them. You have to do something where they see the ability to analyze a problem, to propose a solution, to implement that solution and test it to see if it's working. That's how you convince people that that component of research is, is real. So much of the research we're doing right now is applied to Kentucky issues. And those issues aren't just Kentucky issues, but if we can solve them in this area, uh, we can then extend that and translate that to other parts of the country and the world. We're looking at energy from a wide variety of areas, but the reason we are is because it could create a lot of jobs in the state. And we're going to have to come up with research, find new ways to create energy. And so making research real is, uh, is, is not only solving problems, but it's also creating new kinds of jobs. It's my belief that if we create those companies in this region based on the research that we do, that that will retain some of our bright Kentucky students to stay in the state, not go to California or Boston. If they stay in the state and if they start a company that grows, most likely many of them, since place is very important to Kentuckians, would like to go back to where they came from.